Hey guys, I'm super excited to take you guys along today on this functional check flight of a set of brand new F-16 smoke winder smoke generators on this Hawker Sea Fury. For this flight, we'll be using this SX-300 for photo chase. ground test all of our generators before we ship them. Since we've done some recent flight testing with smoke winders on Argonaut, we had uh, everything ready to go. The smoke winder is a self-contained airshow smoke making device designed to sit on the tip rail of an F-16. It can also be hung vertically underneath the rail, but regardless, designed to be on a frontline fighter uh, flying at an air show. Here you can see I'm filling them with fluids. The generator runs on 100 low lead gasoline and air show smoke oil. The generator is air breathing, so it has an inlet on the side of the generator that feeds oxygen into the generator, then it lights that air on fire with some 100 low lead gasoline, and then we insert uh, regular air show smoke oil, much like you'd see on your pits or whatever at an air show, to make the smoke. With having all of the tanks inside of the generator, as well as the pumps and the ignition system, etc., you can take uh, effectively a frontline active duty fighter and turn it into an air show plane for a weekend, do your demo, and then put it back on the front line come Monday. So, with the right one installed, now we're installing the left generator. The, uh, the rail is actually a F 16 launcher rail that we've mounted on the Sea Fury. So, all this mounting process is the same as it is with a Sidewinder missile. So since smoke generation is for air shows, it ends up being really a visual medium. So the idea is about just about capturing with a camera uh, the fact that the generators are running or how well they are running. We mount GoPros on the airplane out here at the wingtip pointing in at the generators on both sides and we mount one here on top of the fuselage looking back so you can see the two smoke generators coming back behind the pilot. We also rely on air to air footage. The crew for today's flight will be Joel Swagger flying Argonaut, Elliot Sigwin myself flying the SX-300, Jeff Highsmith will be flying in the SX as cameraman, and Katie Ludi will be sitting in the back seat of Argonaut running the smoke generators. Uh, you go ahead and come down. Ground up. Ground up, how do you guys hear? Loud clear. Loud clear. Doing good, Katie? Yeah, all good. And uh, run up to complete, we're gonna go. Okay, I'm going to close the canopy and we'll do the run up. Okay, all set, Katie? All set. Okay, and uh, Sea Fury's rolling 1 9.
So there's three data points that we wanted for today's flight. The first point was a light at 250 knots. We use 250 knots for two reasons. First off, 250 knots ends up being sort of the heart of the envelope, both for the generator and for the Sea Fury behind me. So it works out really nice that way. Also, 250 knots is the speed that most of the F-16s fly when they're doing their parade flyover, like a military style flyover. So it ends up being a useful speed for them. Okay, Katie, we're on speed. We can go ahead and uh, turn the inverter on and then we can do our 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off. We'll do two of those. And we've got smoke on both sides. We're gonna let it run for 30 seconds. Looks great from here. Turn them off. Okay. Back on. And I see them both on. Looks good. And off again. For the second data point, we wanted to get a standard light from about this angle right here. So by showing the belly of the airplane, we can see the two smoke generators there. By showing the belly, you can see the full length of the generator and you can see the smoke come off the bottom. And we wanted to get that from both angles. So both from the left side and the right side. The first point that we got was on, was a right hand turn. So with the chase plane out front, turning to the right, Sea Fury in dash two, and then stacked high on the inside of the turn like this. After that point was complete, we did a cross under so Joel swapped over to the other side and now he's on the inside of a left hand turn like so and he's gonna stack high again and then we have that same shot again okay I see a second shutdown we're gonna start for the inside of the turn let me know when you have visual okay sounds good I'll start slowing it down cameraman has you in sight okay and I'm gonna go right to uh, stack high position Sounds good. We have the shot. Go for light. Go ahead, Katie. Turn to one. And uh, the winder's off. And off. Off. Okay, you need for a uh, uh, cross under. Okay. I'll switch over to a left hand turn. I uh, let them call it. Okay, smoke winders on. Smoke winders on. Corner just like that. Yeah, you want to do one more? Smoke winders on. Smoke winders on. Cameraman's happy, I think that point's complete. The third point was a cross under shot that had worked really well on previous flights. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put the Sea Fury out front. And we're gonna move the photo ship into dash two. So in order to do that, we're gonna need to do a lead change. Then we're gonna position the SX behind and at the same altitude as the Sea Fury. We're gonna turn the smoke generators on. We're gonna cross under underneath the smoke and back up to the other side and then turn the smoke generators off. This ends up making a really cool effect where the smoke goes right over the camera, sort of like this. If you can do it nice and symmetric, you would have the generators turn on and turn off at the same points of that arc and you would be able to, to move the airplane nice and smooth from left to right without uh, having the airplane get too low and get in the propeller arc. So there's the propeller in front of me in the front seat and get too high and get above the canopy bow in the SX300. Okay, sounds good. I'm gonna uh, step it back a little bit and uh, then I'll give you a chance to uh, move uh, to number two. Sounds good. And I'll let you call when you want smoke on and off. I think Katie can hear you pretty well. Sounds good. We're gonna do a practice one real quick. Okay. Okay, we're ready for smoke winders on now. On. Smoke winders off. And we're 
Spellfinder's on in a second, hang on, I'll give you the call. Spellfinder's on. Spellfinder's off. Very nice, and we'll take you back. Sounds good, left turn here, I'm gonna head for the overhead. There's some of our smoke. Rad. Okay, right turn for the initial. Okay, go ahead and turn them on. Okay, we can turn them off. Awesome, good job. <laughs> 